Ever wonder if you ended up in prison? What are you going to do to pass time? No internet, no video games, and no gym. You might think inmates just stare at the wall or just get into brawls, but what do inmates really do? One of the activities they do is play card games. You know, your common poker, spades, blackjack, and bridge. But most of the time, these games come with some gambling involved. Inmates would gamble on sexual favors, who gets to watch what's on TV, prison commissary items, and so on. Of course, playing games with criminals, you winning a game could often lead to fights or even stabbings. Talk about being a sore loser. Prison is for scum and lowlifes. <laughs> what other better way to burn time than working out? Well, some prisons have access to weights, but majority of prisons around the world don't due to safety concerns. Well, no one wants a 50 pound plate flying in front of your face. <laughs> But how in the world did Mike Tyson come out of prison looking like he's gonna bite someone's ear off? Like, jacked. Mike explained he had nothing to do, so generally he occupied his time by doing some calisthenics. Hundreds of push-ups, sit-ups, and squats, each day along with his shadow boxing. And even running for hours in his room. Even without weights, inmates would find the most creative ways to improvise their workout equipment, such as beds for bench press, towels for lateral raises, and even wholesomely doing workouts together. This next one might surprise you. Inmates keep themselves occupied by keeping themselves clean. Yeah, for fun. They participate in cleaning activities like sweeping and mopping, literally. Inmates would not only clean their cell, but the hallway and the common areas as well. Participation in cleaning activities would earn you some stripes and attention from the head honcho, also known as the prison boss. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we also have forgiven our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. As evil as inmates may seem, they're still human, and many of them still have beliefs. Better yet, many of them still practice the religion. In an American prison, inmates themselves would host a Bible study group, often together in a cell, praying for each other. Kind of wholesome. Fun fact, majority of the inmates in the United States happen to be Protestant Christians. Prison can get lonely. For many, it's the best time to release your creativity into art or songs. So many inmates actually end up writing music and eventually becoming artists. Or some inmates are already artists. Many legends such as Tupac, Woody Guthrie, Merle Haggard have written their songs while in their cell. In 1968, the legend Johnny Cash even performed his crime-inspired song called Folsom Prison Blues at Folsom State Prison in California. He didn't write that song in jail though. He did however spend a few nights in jail on various occasions. That may have inspired him to write that song. If you went to prison, how would you spend your time there? Let us know. We read your comments and appreciate every single one of you. So if you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe.